Hello everyone, welcome back to Hearthstone. Alright. This is just later on the same day as the last run, where I finished 6-3. That's kind of reinvigorated my drive. I'm thinking, I can do this! I can do this! I can get to 12 wins. I can do it. Someday. Probably not today. But maybe today. It could happen. Alright. Let's see what we get. Alright, definitely not the hunter. I do actually have a daily quest that involves a paladin. I don't think Spectre's having too much luck in the arena at the moment. Major paladin, daily quest or mage? Hmm. Hmm. Losing because the game throws me high costers at the start. Yep. That happens. It sucks. Which one's better for Arena? How much experience do I have playing Paladin? Not much. I have a bit more experience playing... Oh, wow. I didn't realize he was that close to... Losing the match. Still, though. 3-3. Three, three. Not bad. Hmm. I have a bit more experience with mage. Ah, what the hell? Let's try paladin. I will fight with honor. <sighs> what the hell kind of a selection is this? Arcane golem. Just no. Blood cell corsair. Just no. Abomination. I guess. Sure. Young Priestess, if you can keep it alive, it can be damn good. If you can't, it sucks. Still, though, I mean, it's a 2-1 for 1, which... You know, that's not a bad card. Let's go with that. I'm gonna prioritize low costers, as usual. River Crocolisk. <laughs> I will take almost any weapon... ...when I'm playing in an arena. Except that one. A 1-4, one just... No. I'm not going to take that. Let's go with the Blessing of Wisdom for some card draw. Hmm. Spell damage. Well, at the moment I don't have any spells, so I don't really want to bank on that. Murdlock Tidehunter. Scarlet Crusader. Both good cards. Let's go with the uh, Tidehunter. Noble Sacrifice. You know, I think if there's any... If there's any secret for the Paladin I would take, it might be that one. But let's go with the Scarlet Crusader. Light Warden. Amazing card if you are a priest. Or maybe even if you happen to be fighting a priest. Since even if the enemy heals, it also will trigger that. But Defender Vargas is damn good. Let's go with that. Alright, we have big ones. Big ones here. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, Frost Elemental gets you some control on the board. That's nice. Wind Fury Harpy combined with the buffs that I'm hopefully going to get later on. Paladins have very strong buffs after all. Could be insane. But I can't really bank on getting those, so let's go with the Frost Elemental. It's the most reliable. Hammer of Wrath. Yeah, a little bit of removal and a card draw. <laughs> Divine Favor. No, n not, not when I have an Aldor Peacekeeper. I mean, a 3-3 three, three for 3 that changes an enemy's uh, an enemy minion's attack to 1, that is... That is mind-blowingly amazing to me. Sunwalker? Or Violet Teacher? Hmm. Sunwalk Sunwalker's a pretty amazing card. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Another Blessing of Wisdom. Hmm. 
Hmm. I almost want to go with another Blessing of Wisdom. And then just never get any other card draw card. Almost. Hmm. Let's do that. Alright, no more card draw cards. Redemption, no thanks. I don't have any spell break. Uh, let's go with more low cost or so. After all, that is what I want to prioritize. Give a minion Divine Shield. That could be amazing. Could be. But, once again, focus on low costers. Direwolf Alpha. I don't want more card draw. I'm good. Hmm. Let's Dark Iron Dwarf. Consecration! Ooh. Well, Archon Protector is also damn, damn good, but I really have to go with it with the Consecration here. Do I want some taunt? At the moment, the only taunt I have these. Uh, at the moment, the only taunt I have is the Defender of Argus. What do I have to protect? Young Priestess. Oh yeah, I've got the Abomination too. <laughs> Forgot about that weird thing. Hmm. Let's go with the Mogishan Warden. Joe and Yeti. Hmm. I've already got three four costers, which isn't bad. I don't know if I want more. Not when I need lower costers more. Let's go with the Torn Warrior. Do I want some silence? Maybe? Maybe. I don't know, I'm starting to think silence isn't as important as maybe I think it is, at least in Arena. I don't know, I mean, when I have silence, I don't see myself... Like, I've never seen myself... ...use it that much. Usually it's like, oh, I wish I had that later, because I don't need it now. Uh, let's go to the Earthen Ring Farce here. <laughs> Draw a card and deal damage equal to its cost. That could be amazing if you had a deck that was oriented around high costers. I don't. And that's unreliable. I don't like unreliable things. Ancient Mage. When combined with something like Consecration could be amazing. Yeah, I mean, that could be comboed with my Consecration and Hammer of Wrath. But I need some lower costers. I don't know if I want a 3-1 charge. Alright, I'll take it. Two costers, please. That's not two coster. Ooh, consecration. Yeah, let's grab another one. Loot hoarder. That's card draw. Don't want that. Actually, do I have any? Yeah, I do have one one coster. Let's go with another one. Blessing of might. That's not good enough to justify a card. A plus three attack and it takes an entire card. Eh. You know, with the um, outdoor peacekeeper that I have, an earthening farseer and. Quite a few other things. Let's go the youthful brewmaster. Do I want another hammer of wrath? Two hammer of wraths and two consecrations? Maybe. Alright, I'm gonna do it. Yep, another two coster. 
humility. Hmm. I wish I just had another Aldor Peacekeeper. It's essentially... Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry, but Aldor Peacekeeper is just better than that. It's just better. Two more mana, and you get the same effect. Plus, you actually get a minion on the board. Of course, since this is a spell, it could be comboed with spell-related things, like the Violet Apprentice or whatever it's called and so on, but... Yeah, I don't really like that. Um... Goljar Footman. Oh, yes. No contest here. True silver, true silver champion. Beautiful weapon. I don't want another Hammer of Wrath. Do I want a Taunt in Rage, or something that gets more bodies on the board? More bodies on the board could be combined with the Direwolf Alpha pretty well. But really, what else? Not really any... well, Defender Vargas. Yeah. Hmm. Alright, yeah, it's Razor Fan Hunter. Alright, last card. <sighs> I don't want another Abomination. I don't want the first Abomination. Okay, well, at this point, I have two Consecrations and two Hammers of Wrath. So, I'm gonna go with Ancient Mage. <laughs> Will this be a special New Year's episode where you play Hearthstone? Until midnight. Kidding. You better be the- I'm, I like this game, but there's no way I would want to do that. Uh, plus, I'm going to run out of gold before I could. Yeah. I can play one more game and then I'm out of gold. Alright, Angel Mage. Alright. I'm pretty happy with this deck. Pretty good amount of low-costers. Good removal. Hmm. I was just thinking, how much late-game punch... Do I have? I actually don't have much. I have a Frost Elemental and a Sunwalker. Whoops. Hmm. Yeah, I'm a little bit lacking there. But aside from that, it's pretty good. Decent amount of taunt, some nice buffs. For my spell damage things, I have two Consecrations, two Hammers of Wrath. Yeah, some pretty nice stuff. There's always Constructed. True. True. I don't know. I find a, I find a reader a lot more fun than Constructed, though. In general, although I have to admit that playing a constructed... I'm um, actually made. The first time I played Paladin was a little while ago when I made a Murloc Paladin deck. And it was actually a lot of fun to play such an absurd deck. I just threw it together for fun. And it took me from rank like 24 or 25 to rank 18, I think. Oh. I will fight with honor. I don't think I want to toss a single thing, no. That's a really good starting hand. But, uh, yeah. My first Paladin deck was a, a novelty Murloc deck where I didn't even have all the Murloc cards or anything like that. Do you need a blessing? And it took me from rank 25 or 24 to about 18 on a constant win streak. Never lost a single game. It's like 5 to 10 in a row. Hmm. Are they going to defy us? X marks the spot. Oh. Well, at least they had to burn a lot to do that. I'm okay with that. Hmm. It's actually pretty nice. Next turn I could Torn Warrior, which will not die to the Blood Sail Raider, but will become enraged. Or they could do that. Oh, Consecration, yeah! Maybe not. 
Alright. They could also kill that. Which they just might. Actually, they probably will. But, I mean, what the hell else am I going to do? Another backstab. Alright. Alright, what are you going to combo with it? You got a combo? No, you don't have a combo. Okay. Moshan Warden put up a taunt wall and then wait for them to play more and then out then consecration. I wonder. Yeah, let's do it. Beat through my wall. Oh, your non-combo eviscerate? Oh my god. They're burning a lot of cards. They're burning a lot of cards. Okay. Do I consecrate now, or do I wait for them to play more? They have 9 damage on the board. I could neuter that Razor Fen Hunter. That sounded weird. <laughs> but I mean, take away its damage potential. I'm going to assume that they're going to attack past me. Will they attack past me, or will they try to destroy the stuff on my board? I hope they attack past me. Because I want them to play more minions. I wonder. Hmm. I'm not sure if that was the right call. What have you got? What is it? Betrayal. They're burning a lot of cards to kill relatively weak stuff. I'm kind of okay with that. They're still not playing more. I guess they don't... They probably don't have many minions. Or... No low costers. They seem to have a lot of spells, that's for sure. Goldshard Footman's actually a good play here. Yeah, should absorb both hits. Or, well, the dagger and one hit. Ready for action. I could really use one of my card draw cards right about now, or a bigger creature. Such as a Sunwalker, for example. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Oh. I kind of want to just hold on to this Consecration. Alright, if I do, if I hero power and then use a Dark Iron Dwarf on it, they're just going to kill the 3-1 with the 1-1, and then kill my 4-4 with a 4-2. Which is not great for me. 
So I think a stronger play is probably just... Hmm. I want to wait for them to play more. Should I wait for them to play more? Reporting for duty. It's only five damage on the board. I'm... I don't know if this is the right play, but I'm gonna wait for them to play more. They'll never know what it And maybe not the right play. Oh, my blessing of wisdom. Wonderful. the hell's the right play here? I wonder... Hmm. I wonder... I guess just get it out. Yeah, I guess I just need to get it out there. Next turn, they can just trade it with their Nightblade. That's not good. Right, well, GG. Well, okay, okay, not quite. Reporting for duty. My seal for Argus. Almost GG. I mean, they might have something in their hand that makes it GG. They can get six damage in my face right now. Well, actually, seven. Eight, nine? That's still not elite. Oh, wait. Four. Oh, yeah. Well played. Well, that looked nice to begin with, but it didn't end nice. Not sure if I misplayed that or what. I don't know. It's really annoying when I lose something and I don't know why. It's nice if I can say, oh, I made this mistake, I made this mistake, I can avoid that in the future, and things will be better, but so often it seems like I'm just left thinking, I'm left shrugging my shoulders, thinking, I don't know. Like, where did I go wrong? I don't know. Oh god, another rogue. Fun to play, not to fight. I will fight with honor. Hmm. It's my only defender of Argus. Do I really want a wolf rider? Against a rogue? Not really. He's just gonna die to the hero power. Ah. <sighs> That's not good. That's a bit better. Do I coin it? They're just gonna hit the young priestess in the face. There's no point in playing that. Okay. I wonder. Oh. 
I'm thinking Blessing of Wisdom. This would heal it up to a 3-3, which means they would need to use their hero power plus what's on the board to kill it. Let's do that. And of course, if they don't kill it, and if it goes unanswered, I can just keep getting cards from it. I'm guessing they're going to kill it. No! They're going to leave it. Okay, I don't know if that's a good idea. Right, well, I'm just going to get another card. True Silver Champion, hello. That's going to be useful. Probably just Razor Fan Hunter. Well, this is a good beginning. But good beginnings often have bad endings. Yeah, now they're finally going to kill it, right? Yep. It's okay, though. Got a serious amount of damage off, and... Ooh, nice play. Probably going to kill my... Yep. I got two cards out of it, so totally worth it for me. Consecration! No. True Silver Champion. It's a waste. In fact, what do I play? Hmm. I almost want to play the Argent Squire and the Mind Control tech. If I play this, I can make that up to a 4-1 and attack him in the face, but then they're just going to kill it. But maybe I'm okay with that. Let me think. Maybe I'm okay with that. Maybe. Maybe. Right, that is going to... I uh, can't quite die. Maybe it doesn't need to. Goldshire Footman can take the blow. Goldshire Footman loves to blow. I don't have a lot of strong minions here. Yeah, I'm definitely lacking on the punch side. There's no doubt about that. In fact, I can almost kill them this turn. The True Silver Champion and my Dark Iron Dwarf. Hmm. Should have done that first, of course. Didn't think of it until just now. Alright. Truth is my shield. Fair enough. I have a big taunt too. Do I want to put it up? Sadly, True Silver Champion will not kill it. Do I have any good options here? I don't like this. Hmm. It's 
It's going to trade really poorly with anything I have. I'm just going to leave him there. Hope I have a better way to deal with that next turn. I can pop off the Divine Shield with my 1-1 one, one without losing it, which is what I'm hoping to do, rather than sacrificing all of my creatures. And yeah, I mean, that, that wouldn't be good. And with what they have on the board, they'd have to use everything against my Mogshan Warden to kill it. But they have something else. Okay. Plus hero. Yep, hero power. Leaving that free to kill my 4-4. Four, four. Ow. Okay. Consecration looks rather good. Alright, so I could Consecrate. That's dead. I can kill that with my 1-1. One, one. Kill that with my 3-3. Three, three. And what do I get on the board? Scarlet Crusader. Wait a minute, I gotta ask myself, do I have lethal? Let me no, I don't. I most certainly do not, but I'm close. Alright, so I have lethal next turn if they don't remove anything from the board. Or, in fact, even if they remove it with their face, I'm okay with that, because they would still take the damage. I have four damage on the board. And four here. They still took the three damage. Oh, I'm one damage away from lethal. Are you kidding me? One damage. Please don't play it, Dawn. Not a ton, okay. Go Reporting for duty. My seal for Argus. I don't want them to know that I have the weapon yet. Because then they might get paranoid about putting up taunts or stuff. Just gonna hold on to it. I just need them to take one more point of damage. Please don't put up a huge taunt. That's a small taunt. I can deal with that. Come on. What have you got? Oh my god, you have more? That's fine. That still doesn't leave me with lethal, does it? Nope. I just need you to take damage. <sighs> Into the breach. Come on. Come on. I need a hammer of wrath. For the 
king! Oh no. Right. Reporting for duty. Sometimes I forget things. For justice. Okay. <laughs> it is a wee bit close. If they don't have a taunt. I might win. Maybe. Maybe I shouldn't have played anything on the board. Now they can enrage it. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have played anything on the board. They can enrage their raging organ. They can do that! Mm hmm. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, wow! Whew. That was a close one. That was close. I just need to win four more to complete my daily quest. Cozy Lamps is their name? Oh, it sounds so cute. Cozy Lamps. Many tips for playing rogues. Ooh, I almost want to keep the True Silver Champion just because it's my only weapon. In fact, I will. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. Oh, God. Hmm. Wow, seriously? Like, my only big stuff is what I'm getting? That's great. Ready for action. Well met. My Sunwalker and my Frost Elemental. Aren't those my only six costers? Put this apple on your head. Wonderful. I've pretty much already lost. Dark Iron Dwarf, or True Silver Champion. If I have Dark Iron Dwarf, it can die to everything they have on the board, which is a hero power plus a three coster for a four coster. Hmm. I don't know. I wonder. I must move quickly. 
Well, I don't know what's a better play. Thing is, I can't really do anything next turn aside from my true silver champion. I can't play any more minions. That's a good play. Thankfully, I have my true silver champion, so I can actually make my way through that. Plus, I have a 3-1, which makes that particularly easy, but... Yeah, that card is hard to deal with. It is powerful. It is really powerful. And well worth the overload, I think. Hmm. Right. So I could bash through both of you with these characters, and play this, and my hero power, or I could bash through one with that, and my true silver champion, and then... Let me think. For justice! Next turn, I could taunt wall or control with my frost elemental. It's still a taunt. Or I could get a bunch of stuff out. Not sure if that was the best play, but... Gets a lot of stuff on the board. <laughs> you can use a Hex against a 3-1. I'm actually perfectly okay with that. And you have to hit it. With your healing totem. I'm very, very much okay with that. Three damage. Right, well the Sunwalker is not a great play here because its Divine Shield can just be popped off by a lowly Imp. Or Healing Totem. Ooh, that Healing Totem is going to combo really well with the Imp Master, I just realized that. The thing kind of needs to die. Screw your healing totem. Stop it. I must move quickly. Engaging TC-130. Mental dislocator. Sucks. Why? Behold the might of Stormwind! Ouch. That's a good play. That Imp Master is going to be the death of me. Hmm. 
Wow. Wow, that, yeah, that Imp Master combined with the Storm and Champion is nasty. I wish I had Consecration right about now. Hmm. Well. Let me think. Jesus. That's going to spiral out of control. It's already spiraled out of control. That's 12 damage on the board. Reporting for duty. I don't know if I should just kill that thing or just hope for a consecration. I do have two. They're probably just going to go for me. I actually have exactly lethal in my hand if they don't kill anything I have. That's a big if, but if they don't kill anything I have, I have lethal. Okay. No, I don't. But if I give my true silver champion, which I think I already used, didn't I? I did. Okay. You're gonna suicide that? The Ambassador's just gonna die next turn. They're gonna get another one out of it, though. Right. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That is not lethal. Pretty sure I've lost. Yeah, I need to remove stuff from the board. They have lethal. Hmm. Alright, this thing is the most valuable thing to kill. Whoops. They have a lot of cards and I don't. Where are my card draw cards? That's 17 cards. Feel the power. Ooh. Oh, man. Not the face. Not the face. Oh, actually, not the face. Alright, seven damage on the board. Reporting for duty. 
Sometimes I forget things. That's a surprising thing to facelessly manipulate. Yeah, okay, I've lost. That is pretty much a perfect play to play right now. They don't have lethal on the board, though, so... Where am I? <laughs> I don't know. Take it back, I Rebel guess. Drink with me, friend. Sometimes I More spell damage that I can't use. Really, the only thing I can play. It's 11 damage potential if they have pretty much anything in their hand. That can do direct damage, I'm dead. <laughs> they just need 3 damage in their hand. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, Fire Elemental is an extremely good card. One, two. Well, I did get to two losses with my Warrior deck before I took it to six wins. Like, my Warrior deck went really badly. And then went really well. Is this one going to do the same? Probably not. Tokemon. Bring victory. I will fight with honor. Tokemon, is that like a non-copyright infringing version of Pokemon? Right, Outdoor Peacekeeper, do I want that now? Not really, but it is a three coster, so I probably... Well, you know, I have the useful Brewmaster. Hmm. Maybe. I'll keep it. Well met. Greetings. Hmm. 
うんチャージダウンキープスオンマイボードアタックイグノーツレーザーフェンハンターI can kill that and use for Brewmaster it to get it back. Let me think. Or. Last warning. <laughs> Or. Or I could do that, hope they don't have any way to kill it this turn, and then next turn I could Youthful Brewmaster it. I could attack with it, Youthful Brewmaster it, and play it again. Assuming they don't have a taunt. If they have a taunt and it has any damage at all, of course the Eldor Peacekeeper will simply die, and I can't、uh, Brewmaster it back, but. Yeah, I like that play.、Mm. Pay attention, class. All right. Yeah, I, I like my plan. Make that thing very ineffective. Take it down to one damage. Of course, any spells cast will, you know, bring out the, the things, but still. Pro MLG plays. And it actually was really satisfying to do. That was a pretty cool play, I think. That was also a very pro play. Wow. You silenced the debuff. Clever. That was really, really clever. Sometimes I think I actually forget that you can do that. You can actually silence effects like that. Can you, can't you even unfreeze one of your own things with a silence? I think you can. Anyway, this is obviously the right play, so. Eat everything they have and still not die. Yeah. You can't attack that.
Wait a minute, do I have lethal? Eight, nine, ten, eleven. I do have lethal. Yeah. GG. Three more wins and I complete my daily quest. Okay. One more win and I will be at least moderately happy with this run. Not the greatest. Not bad. I don't want mind control tech this early. Well met. The light me. <laughs> Where's all my two costers? That is not a two-coster. Wow, I guess I don't have any good cards. Okay. Acidic Swamp Ooze might be the way to go. Torn Warrior doesn't make much sense. They have nothing on the board. Given that there's nothing on the board, the Acidic Swamp Ooze Let me can do more damage. Oh, I might as well go with the Razor Fed Hunter. I really don't have much to play. I hate that card. What card? Paladin Legendary, 6-6 six, six Taunt, Divine Shield, and when it dies, it gives them a, I believe, 5-3 weapon. Oh, yeah, what's that called? Um, that thing's a beast. Is it Tyrion? Or, no, I'm not sure. Let me think. 
Engaging TC Hunter Central What we do. Oh, is that why you were waiting? Because of that? Now I wish I had silent. <laughs> Double abomination? That doesn't make much sense. Alright. Well. Let me think. Well. Powerful, but with my Sunwalker in hand, doesn't particularly matter. Beat yourself up against my Divine Shield, have fun with that. I don't have lethal, right? Put that in there, I get 4, 4, 8, 9. No, that's not even close to lethal. Alright. Oh, God. Can't go for me. All right. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I see what to do. Okay. Ooh, this is actually gonna turn out really nicely. Yeah. Let me think. All right. Let me make sure I do this right. Lock that down. Buff these up. Pop the divine shield. Kill you, and I keep it. That turned out really nicely. Alright, unless I have something pretty insane, I think I've got this. What have you got? Alright, they give a taunt. <laughs> and a whole hell of a lot of health. Is it gonna save him, though? Ooh, yeah, that's gotta save him. Oh. My. God. J what? <laughs> okay. Right. Twelve. See what I get. That doesn't particularly help. All right. I can do seven damage to them directly.
I'd rather keep this around. Still, though, I'm pretty sure I still have a lethal. No? You can't do that. I've got to have lethal, right? Right? Pop the divine shield, one, two. Yeah. The battle! Alright, I'm now fairly happy, and if I can get two more wins and complete my daily quest, I will be ecstatic. of wisdom. I might actually want to keep that. Yeah, I'll keep that. And I'll keep the Torn Warrior, but I want something else for that slot. Excellent. Excellent. Really? Really? Well met. Both of my blessings of wisdom. Okay, fine. There's gonna be a lot of blessings and a lot of wisdom. I'm hoping that being so early, without being able to play that much, I can hopefully combo. I mean, I can hopefully use the Blessing of Wisdom and attack a lot. Before they can even deal with what I have on the board, but that's probably... Yeah, that's not going to be true. Never mind. Eh, Torn Warrior might be the way to go. Yeah, three coster for a three coster. Hmm. Then what do I play next turn? Like a Blessing Wisdom attack, and if they attack it and kill it, that's fine? Or is it? Wait, I already attack with that? I... I thought... Wait, can't... What the f... Yeah, I hadn't attacked with it. That's what I thought. What the... Why the fuck could I select it? I just saw it light up green as soon as I pressed end turn. The hell? Thanks, game. Jesus. <sighs> Follow the rule. I should have done this first to see what card I was going to get. Nah, probably wouldn't have changed anything. So is what they have on the board right now. They'd have to sacrifice two for one. Never mind. And I'm really, really glad I have the Acidic Swampoos. They are going to cry in just a minute. The 
the light protects me. Reporting for Well played. I'm glad they used their consecration on that, though. Hmm. I almost want a blessing of wisdom, my 1 1. Seems kind of dumb, though, doesn't it? Game. Game. Can I please attack with my 1-1? One, one? What the f- Fine, I'll end my turn then. Fuck you, game. And What the f- I must move quickly. <sighs> Game. 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 Seriously. And disconnections are counted as an automatic loss. I believe. Your game has been disconnected from the battle.net game service. Or, no. That one was not. Huh. I don't know what's going on. I know they have scheduled maintenance in a little while, but it's not today. It's two days from now, so... Wait a minute. What? Wait, so it did count as a loss. I just clicked the back... Whatever. I finished 3-3 three, three then. I finished 3-3, three, three, and I got over 50 gold. Huh. That's actually really good. Okay, well, I can't say I'm disappointed with myself or anything, because I didn't lose the last game. Yep, that was the Battle.net servers, or the game, or my internet, I don't know. Montage of your LP of cold fear with all the times you had Hanson spinning around. To the song, you spin me right round. <laughs> I don't know if I want the match third-party content, but that would be funny. No, oh, two rares. Okay, cool. Alright, well, I hope everyone enjoyed that uh, arena run that came to a rather abrupt stop. Don't know what happened. Stuff happens. This game's in beta. There's network issues. Could have been my internet, I don't know. Who knows? But anyway, I will be back soon with another arena run.